The exhibition is opening, yeah, and, uh, and we do have a Blu-ray coming out, don't we? <laughs> Which is great. And this is like a premiere of one of the movies. It's fantastic. We played golf in it. <laughs> this place, um, they follow Tom, Oliver, myself and Rupert on a game of golf, and we literally just chilled out just talking about our experience on over the last 10 years, and it's... We were quite hands-on in it as well, weren't we? Like, doing yeah, well, like, and the thing is, well, we wanted to do something where we could just speak to each other about, like, what was your best memory of filming? How did you like doing this? So it's a lot more personal for not only us, but for the fan base to view it. That it's not some, you know, some random person asking the questions. You know, so it's what we enjoy doing about it. Because we're not there every day of shooting, we'll quite see what we missed out on that we heard about. So yeah, it's, it's so, yeah, it's, it's so much to see and do in on the DVD. And, yeah, it's, I mean, it's certain, it certainly um, makes the life of, of, the, uh, of the disc as well last a lot longer because you can watch the same film about four different times and see a different thing every time you watch it. So. When you're on the set, there's, there's also uh, hundreds of people and uh, a lot of expensive machinery and cameras and lights and that, and so you don't always get to have a good look at things. So it's, it's nice that they've now been put in isolation, so their focus is entirely on the craftsmanship of the people who made these things because they are incredible. We don't have very many um, scenes that we don't include in the film normally, but this time we have a very nice scene at the beginning of, that would have been at the beginning of the film, which was a lovely scene with Dudley saying goodbye to Harry at Privet Drive. And it just, the rhythm of the film, the cutting, just didn't allow space for it. It's a shame because it's a lovely, lovely scene. I think people will love that. There is the uh, max, uh, maximum movie mode, which I can never get right. Um, where the fans are guided through aspects of making the film, uh, the, the actual process of making the film, by uh, some of the filmmakers and uh, members of the cast in a way that um, I think will be really informative uh, and really fun for people who are interested in how things are done. Uh, there's a great feature on The Seven Harriers where the, the Order of Phoenix went to Privet Drive uh, and turned themselves into uh, six more Harris to as decoys for the escape from Privet Drive. Uh, and there's a, a, a good feature on how that was done, showing Daniel, who worked very, very hard at that sequence. He was filming it for about a week or more. Um, and yeah, there's lots of stuff, I think, that people... And a bit of fun, too. There's the, 
the, the um, Phelps twins who, who uh, played Fred and George uh, and Tom Felton go golfing. Uh, and uh, so <laughs> that's just a bit of fun, the showing wizards in their everyday normal life. It's, it's, a, it's a pretty big month for Harry Potter. Um, I mean, I got to see the exhibit, which is very cool. Lots of detail and, and, and you get to be in the world of Harry Potter. And then, of course, you got the, uh, the DVD release on Blu-ray, which is very cool. Um, and then on top of that, then you've got the next film, the final film that's coming out this summer, which is also very cool. So it's, there's a lot going on in the world of Harry Potter and it's kind of sad because you just don't want it to end. But, yeah.